Actually, I haven't played this game in a while. And um, I had to dig it out. I had to hit him with the tentacles. It's nothing. This is one of my favorite parts of this game. But anyway, let's get the show started. Okay, so not having it back with another Game Caviar production. I'm sitting in the uh, Game Caviar studio and I'm playing a game that has never been seen on this channel before. Prototype! I love this game. Let me tell you why. This game is very fun to play. The storyline is amazing and uh, I, I really believe that if Hollywood really put a lot of money in behind really producing this as a a high class and high budget film it will tear the box office up you play as a guy called Alex Mercer and he's got some sort of special powers he has a lot of special powers uh, superhuman powers actually and I will be I will be using a lot of them during the course of this video uh, basically what he is trying to do is figure out what has happened to him. He's trying to re, uh, what is it, piece together his memory. And there's a lot of ways of doing that. One of the main ways of doing it is actually doing the missions that they give you in the game. Another way is by uh, grabbing and consuming persons of interest. Now, in order to get health in this game, one of the ways you can do it is you grab somebody and you consume them and he literally consumes that being and depending on what type of uh what type of person or monster he uh, consumes that determines how much health you get and you'll see me do it a lot because i have to i am fighting a major boss this is a major boss battle the thing about this uh game is that during boss battles it's not just you and the boss it's the in this case it's the boss inside of a uh, actually in a city block we're in Times Square actually in New York City the real New York City they use the real city uh, they in and the boss has jumped up out of the ground and me being the uh, maniacal superhero I have to destroy her in order to uh, advance in the story but while I'm fighting her, I'm also fighting these big monsters right here that are punching me. I'm fighting these zombie-like humans that have been effect infected by this virus. I have to deal with all of this while at the same time keeping an eye on the main boss and making sure that I devise a strategy and actually... Ooh, fancy footwork. And actually um, uh, follow through on my strategy to defeat her. Now, this... This isn't a real-time video. Of course, this isn't live commentary or anything. There's no way. This, this, I, I recorded this video and it was over 30 minutes long. I had to compress and condense 30 minutes of footage down into a little bit over eight minutes. So there's going to be a lot of cutting in and out and everything. Uh, so, you know, I, I made it to where a lot of the action is still in the video while taking out a lot of the slow parts because there was there's a lot of me climbing on top of buildings just to get away from the boss while i try to fight these damn big muscular creatures and that that i didn't want to add that into the video because it's, it's you know it's not as great as seeing the action and i had to focus on those i had to focus on the little slow parts and able to stay alive long enough for me to defeat the boss and right here i'm using my special tentacle kill everybody ability i forgot what it's called but i have a lot of them that one is my favorite because it does a lot of damage to a lot of people at one time the only downfall of using that is that it takes a couple seconds for him to actually deploy the tentacles so while you're getting ready to use it you're vulnerable and if somebody were to attack you it, uh, it knocks you out of the sequence and you have to reset and start yourself. And you can't use it whenever you want to. I have to have a full bar of health. Uh, when you have a full bar of health, it gets to where the top part or the forward part is light blue. And that lets you know that your abilities are fully enabled and you can go ahead and use them. Every time you use them, it takes a, a, a bit of your health away. So if you have this game, if you haven't played it, keep this in mind. Now, the, another reason why I started playing this game is that Prototype 2 is coming out this year. 
in a month or so or maybe a couple months it's coming out soon well i want to beat this game before i even start looking at videos for prototype 2 i know of prototype 2 but i haven't listened i haven't watched any videos i haven't read any information about it because i don't want any information about the second game to ruin the first game uh i think i, I know i'm pretty far into the game but i don't know how close i am to the end i know that i don't want this game to end but i know it has to and uh i i just i really like this game and a, a lot of times when i say that this game is better than infamous people kind of look at me crazy but to me this game is really better than infamous the the it's grimier it's grittier you're in new york city you're in a real city the uh the the storyline has hollywood roots in it something that you could go to the movies and see and it's really good so that's why i put this above infamous too uh let me see here i didn't i've transitioned a lot and i'm just about i'm just about at the end uh let me see I, like i said this guy has superheroes powers he can climb over buildings run really fast he has superhuman strength he can morph he can absorb another person and morph into them including soldiers let me see I have, i'm using my blade right now because it's very powerful uh and i'm using a, a armor that kind of covers your body kind of like the uh the suit on crisis but uh it's more organic and more natural uh let me see uh let me talk about the channel real quick we've got uh we've gained some subscribers here in the past couple days and i really appreciate everything that the subs have been doing we've re we've received a lot more uh uh a lot more traffic to the site which i'm glad for and right now uh if you're seeing this do me a favor and subscribe to the channel uh subscribe comment uh on one of our videos or all of our videos as many as you like but we are trying we're in the process of taking our channel to the next level this year so if you could just take time out to subscribe to our channel so you can stay updated and stay current with all of our videos and great content i'm talking about we have gameplay videos vlogs uh this wednesday i'm going to do a video about uh the playstation vita and unboxing and first impressions you know game caviar is here to stay so while you have the time please click subscribe and spread the word let people know about game caviar because we're here to stay and subscribing to our channel is completely free and it takes less than five seconds uh right there at the end i finally beat the boss and now it's going into i consumed her so now i'm getting a bigger part of the past and what's going on uh let me see after this i haven't played anymore i'm gonna play after this video gets finished and i'll probably make another video maybe of the last battle uh yeah that's about it so like i said subscribe to the channel we have a lot of good stuff that has been posted and we're going to keep posting it and i really appreciate everybody's support i'm not having it i'm in the game caviar studios you've been watching prototype and i'm out